guys welcome back to our channel today is friday tgi friday and we are looking to wind down what are you guys gonna do this weekend or tonight to wind down we're going to sea world sunday sunday and then tomorrow we're going around town too and then tonight we're just winding down i just got off from work just got off work and even when you're tired you have to make time mm -hmm. for date night speaking of date night people want to know how we met mark and i so, uh, we, we met on Bumble, uh, 2019, matched in May of 2019, and we texted on Bumble from May of 2019 to October of 2019, and um, and finally met in October of 19 at Bonefish, Bonefish Grill, at the Loop. Right. So, yeah. So Bumble, uh, yeah. <laughs> I like Bumble because the woman has to mm -hmm. swipe first. So you will not get random messages from, you know, men like mm -hmm. Tinder. Anybody can see your photo okay. and message you. And I didn't like that. So the concept that Bumble had was really appealing or intriguing to me because of that. So I really liked Bumble. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Bumble, they're probably the best dating app they probably got the best success rate if i had to guess i think so too and that's it mm. for now we may um give you more details later about our dating life <laughs> <laughs> but we texted for a while it wasn't like um which i think helped because we kind of got to know each other almost like six months so when we finally met it was like yeah you know, nobody was nervous it was just like we knew each other forever that's right uh it was great for all oh, Amazing first date at Bonefish. I can still visualize it in my head. Same. And the rest <laughs> was literally The rest history. is history. <laughs> and then a couple weeks later, we were at Epcot with my mom. Remember? Oh, yeah. Our second date we got was with good, his mom. You can mm -hmm. Matching shirts. We went to um, food and wine. That was a lot of fun. Yeah. He should have known then he was doomed <laughs> to match with me forever. <laughs> 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 but tonight we're going to make a classic margarita so it's three ingredients sugar the rim i have brown sugar and garnish with a lime so the three ingredients we are going to use we are going to use one ounce of triple sec one ounce of sour mix and two ounces of Don Julio. So two ounces of Don Julio, one ounce of triple sec, and one ounce of sour mix. Sugar rim, we're using brown sugar. I don't know if you can see this. That I don't wanna spill the lime juice here. <laughs> so we're gonna dip it in lime juice and then we're going to sugar that rim. And I have my shaker already with ice. Yeah, I always like sugar more than salt. Almost. Yeah, I have. Ugh, I can't do salt. I'd rather do sugar or nothing on it. That makes sense. That's right. Salt would be my least. But normally I do nothing. But I yeah, wanted right. to make the drink so pretty for you guys. And we got your nice new. Um, new oh, that's toy. true. That's true. That's true. Let's see how it how it does. Maybe this is the bar. Hello, me a dream. Mm. How's that? Came out perfect. <laughs> wow I should have zoomed in or so you guys could see me do it Probably, I'm gonna say, wow, 10, 12 years. We went years ago and brought the um, Colton, Lucas, and Reagan. I don't think SeaWorld's good because it's not, it's not as crowded as the uh, it, um Everyone's saying it shouldn't be as crowded as the other parks. SeaWorld? Yeah. Why not? It's just because, you know, everyone comes in, they go to Disney, and SeaWorld's kind of like, I don't want to say the forgotten one, but it's cheaper tickets and. Um, 
it's just that so many people flock on Disney that SeaWorld, while it's still crowded, don't get me wrong, it's not three hour waits. Does that make sense? Got it. What is there to do at SeaWorld? They do, um, they're transitioned into road, more roller. It used to be, they used to do whale and dolphin shows, but, um, the whales killed one of the trainers and then, um, the environmentalists said it wasn't fair to the animals. So they're shifting away from animal shows and fish shows to more roller coasters. Does that make sense? trying to get in the roller coaster game and they got a really nice aquarium should we use straws i just, i'm gonna say do you that. guys use straws when you have do, like a sugar I'm gonna or do, a salted rim i'm gonna start with no straw to get the sugar and then i'll probably switch to a straw okay sounds good but yeah and i think there's a real nice aquarium i'm real excited to see the aquarium me and for mia to see the fish Aww. mia's gonna love it and mia's mia, first trip to sea world yeah mia's first trip to sea world she did her first trip to disney two three weeks ago now so yeah, so she enjoys Seattle. being outside and people watching. Mm -hmm. She loves it. And then we'll get a Universal will be the next one and Legoland. Oh, there's a Sesame Street. One of the co-workers said SeaWorld has a Sesame Street land. I love you, mommy. Elmo whispered in her ear. Elmo's mommy smiled. I love you too, my dear. I've loved you all your life. Every single day. Okay. So I think she would like that. Like Big Bird. She got some books with Big Bird. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Cheers. <laughs> wow. That's excellent. That's good. Mm. That sugar sets it all. Mm. 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 Wow. That's excellent. It's good. That's really good. It's so sticky to my lip gloss. Mm -hmm. That sugar is really good. Look at it. You have an easy cleanup. Yeah. I like how it opens. That's the sugar. Nice. And then that's, that's the, the lime juice. And then the third compartment you can do anything with. Right there. Yeah. Oh. I didn't even know. Oh. Yeah, she got three. I put the sugar. It's okay. <laughs> I put the sugar where the salt should be, That's but right. we don't like salt anyways. So guess what? It'll be too yeah, sugar. We don't need much salt. But yeah. So there you go. And then we'll um a video we'll we'll splice in some photos of Sea World, right? That's all right. This is excellent. Well, maybe tomorrow too. And then here yeah, we're taking Mia out to um. Off 192 uh, Margaritaville. There's a live music and car shows. And just What's the name of the restaurant? Uh, Gloria Stefan's. She's always running. She's ready to run. This is excellent. It's good. Well, I'm excited mm -hmm. that we were able to have date night with you guys and you can see us have date night and this margarita is amazing if you like tequila. Oh, shout out to Heineken. Shout out to Heineken. <laughs> and course. this is good. You don't even taste, this is another one where it don't even taste like, it's like candy. It's so good. You know what I'm saying? 
The sugar another, doesn't help, right? Right. <laughs> but no, you can do two or three of these easy. I mean, that gets you into trouble, you like Mark says. But uh, this is another another home run, babe. Yeah. Thank you again for watching, liking, subscribing, and sharing. And we will see you next time. Bye for now.